All right, friends, lovers, ex-lovers, enemies, cats, dogs, hello, we're back. Nobody asked for it, but here's another video. Last time we left off, we fought a bunch of dudes here. They were really rude, shot at me for no reason. Um, we killed them all, got this door open, and now we're going across. What's Nadine doing? Oh. Alright. I hope everyone's doing well. Washing your hands. Not touching your face. Not giving the Rona to each other. Um, it's crazy. Right outside where I live. Um, Beg your pardon? Oh. I'm fine. Um... So I'm in New York, and this whole coronavirus thing is like kind of a big deal. And New York is like the epicenter of all these cases and deaths in the United States. But I look outside, there's people just like walking around like it's real life, and or like everything's normal. And it's kind of concerning because like I guess where I live, it's just a bunch of yuppies, and they're young, and they realize, oh, I'm not gonna get sick, or rather, I'm, I'm gonna get sick, but I, I won't die from it. But they don't realize, like, they can pass it to older folks who will die from it, you know, but, like that. Um, so, I don't know, they don't realize that there's no respawn in real life. And so, they just act like dummies and go out and pick up their McDonald's and just do whatever and, I don't know. I hope everyone's safe out there. I haven't left my apartment in like three weeks. Um, I've been eating canned beans with tuna, which is a weird mix, but after a while it's okay. Um, and I eat rice. Um, yeah, that's about it. Oh, I eat Wonder Bread and bread that's been in the freezer. I melt it and I toast it. Oh, dialogue. Now let's see what it does. What is it? Ancient Hoysala jigsaw puzzle? Oh. Oh. Ah, of course. I'm making a bow. Uh, uh. I not getting this? Oh. Aha. <gasps> look at that. Panasharama. Now what? Now I guess we turn this crank and see what happens next. Think it's safe? You know that treasure hunting is not a good gig for the risk of us, right? Neither is being a mercenary. Difference hmm. is when I pull the pin on a good night, I'll know what's going to happen next. My way's much more fun. Hmm. <laughs> Did you hear that? You feel that? Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> Look at that. Holy hell. There's a massive relief carved into the side of that mountain. And you were worried we were going to turn that crank and die. Guess it's good I've got an archaeologist's daughter with me. It must have been fun growing up, eh? It had its moments. I learnt a lot. Hoysala Empire was 
kind of his thing. Took up a lot of his time, though. Me, if I go digging for treasure, I better make a buck or two. Oh, sure. I don't take big risks without a good payday. I imagine so. Like running an army, huh? That's a big responsibility. Second nature. It's my father's company. He retired, I took over. Family business? Mm. Made a real mess of it. But you should know. Heard you and those Drake brothers are close. Yeah, well, it's a conversation for another time. So, where to next? There's the fort above the waterfalls with the trident. And there's the fort in the mountains sporting the axe. I suppose I should have asked about the Drakes before I took the job. Not much to tell. I know Nate pretty well, Sam less so. He seemed to just appear out of thin air. Let's find a way to get back down to the car. Sounds good. Huh, so this must be after Uncharted 4 because because she knows about Sam and Sam doesn't come into the picture until Uncharted 4. She also dated oh, this is open now. Nathan Drake, but she doesn't like to tell Nate. Oh, I wonder why. Is she ashamed? I wouldn't be ashamed. Here we go, back at the car. Check. check out, check out this Tokyo Drift driving. Oh. Hey, oh. Just so you know, Oops. Nathan Drake is no longer in the picture. You don't have to worry about him. I had my concerns. Oh. Why do you accept my offer? I'm not one to look a gift horse in the mouth, especially with everyone wanting to see me fall. I hear that. But on the plus side, oh, there's a plus side. Oh, when people have low expectations, it's much easier to take them by surprise. As far as I'm concerned, this business is tough enough on your own. You have to take any advantage you can. Girl power. Alone? Mostly. How old were you when you started? Young. Learned quickly enough I needed to let people think they were getting their way. And then I could get the upper hand. Too subtle for me. I always huh. prefer the direct approach. Yeah, whatever works, I say. I like that they're becoming friends. Look how pretty the flowers are. Wow. Wait, where am I going? Oh, to the right. Wow. Two for two. I randomly guessed those two directions before I even started. Treasure? Butterfly treasure. I wonder why they don't let you use, like, binoculars in this game. I'd like to be able to scope out the enemies before I get up there to see how many there are, because... I don't know, if there's too many, I don't want to deal with it. You know what I'm saying? Hmm. Ah, I need a winch. Oh, she brought the car. Wow. Nice. Good job, Nadine. Thank you. Once more, with gusto. I hope this thing is long enough to get there. Oh, 
shut up. She started the car. She knows what I'm gonna do. Whoa. Here we go. Okay. Oh, now they're taking turns. Yay! They're bringing friends. Go, Nadine. Do it. Be nicer, Chloe. Salah versus the tiger. Salah won, actually. He was protecting his guru and killed the animal in one blow. It's where the name Hoi Salah comes from. Hoi, meaning strike, in their language. Oh my god. Oh, I would never, ever do this. Oh my god. Oh, can't breathe. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh. These dotted walls are their climbing gear. Absolutely filthy. They should come in handy. Correction. Our climbing gear. Oh. God, a bit hard on the wrists. not expecting to see these dots here because I hate them um. where do I go I think I hear voices up ahead. Oh boy. I'll call. There's not a food left to I'm smaller than most men. We are. Shit! What? No way. P90. Slightly deep, but I'm hmm. good. Good. Let's keep moving. Huh. I don't know. P90 is nice, but these augs are next level. Keep moving, eh? Oh. The Desert Eagle is nice, but it's like kind of a one hit kill uh, if they're not wearing armor. But the Desert Eagle rarely like comes with ammo. And so it's really like nerve wracking to not have pistol ammo because I go through rifle ammo so quickly. Um, where are we supposed to go? Oh, sick dive. Oh, climb up there. I will say, this game isn't as like intuitive as 
Uncharted 4. I think Uncharted 4 was easier and like helping you traverse. It gave you better clues like it'd be a dark room and then there'd be one area of the room that had light. That's where you needed oh to go. What the hell is this? Okay, let's see what this does. Oh. That statue moved. Well, let's see how this goes. Oh. Well, I'll be going to hell. That's elaborate. Hey. Uh, oh shit. Statue moved again. What? Oh. Turns out getting walloped by an axe hurts a little. What? Hey you. Want to give it a shot? <laughs> Not paying me nearly enough. I wonder if there's any clues to build. Hmm. Okay. Am I not dead? Who says Bucca? Well, I guess she's British. I guess it moves based on the number times I jump. Okay, so I think I got it. I'm gonna go over here, go here, go here, go here, go here, go here, go here again, go here, like that, jump. Okay. Alright, I think that did it. Come on over. Coming. How is she? How does? Okay. Whatever. It's just a game. Wow. Yeah. It's helpful. Whoa. Look at. Look at the graphics here. Way better than Final Fantasy VII. Oh, for goodness sake. Uh, another one with two different symbols now the star uh, and rings they're all hoysala sun symbols i like this better hey is there some sort of like trick to this Getting old. You can do it twice. You can't do it again. How did you know that? What? Oh.
shoot. Try to keep track of what the statue is about to protect. Oh my gosh. Oh, fresh air. That took forever and I hated that. But I'm loving the graphics and the view. Alright. Well, nice little reminder not to drink alcohol while you're playing this game because the puzzles are way more complex than Uncharted 3 or 4. Outside. Weird smell in there. Death. Smell like death. Yeah. I was well, definitely death. Oh. Oh, the key is used here again. Oh, numb. Guess this will be a feature of an X. Good guess. Here. Nice picture of an X. Nice to see you, Shiva. Shiva. Right, let's turn the water on. Well, well, what's to say it's not different this time? What if it's fire or something? You're messing with me. I'm totally messing with you. Oh, they're friends. <laughs> Here we go. Mm -hmm. oh, I'm a little disappointed it wasn't fire. Another waterfall. Yeah. Two out of three now. Also, I went to an absurd amount of trouble to hide the tusk. Well, the tusk was the symbol of Hoysala dominance, representing their wealth and their might. A nice trophy for the Persians. Yeah. My dad always thought that the tusk was something even greater, though. What? Your dad was after the tusk? Oh, my dad was obsessed with it. He spent every day and night researching it. All our money wasted on fruitless expeditions. Heard that one before. <sighs> so what came of it? I don't know. <laughs> well, he sent me and my mum away. He said it was no longer safe. And off to Australia we went. <laughs> and now here I stand on the outskirts of Halibadu. That's pretty funny. So she's an Australian and the last accent? Above the falls. The one with the trident. Interesting. All right. I think this is. Your accent makes sense now. Yeah. Fraser's not exactly an Indian surname either. It was my mom's. <laughs> Let's head back to the car. Yeah. All right. Good time to end it. <laughs>